I'm going to teach you how to download and install Forge and Forge mods for Minecraft 1.21. Let's go ahead and get started. Now, the first step to install Forge is to click the second link in the description, which is a written guide on how to download and install Forge. Feel free to read through this guide, but if you just want to follow along the video, let's scroll down to step one and click where it says download Forge here. That'll redirect you over here. Make sure you have selected 1.21 here on the left side and then just click on install it right here. That'll redirect you over here where you have to see an ad for five seconds. But after five seconds, you will see this button label as a skip. Go ahead and click on it and that'll begin the download immediately for Forge, okay? And while Forge is downloading, I have to let you know about our sponsor, Apex Hosting. If you're looking for a Minecraft server, either a Java or a Bedrock server, a server where you could install Forge if you want to, to play modded Minecraft, or you could even just install mod packs as straight up. You have support for more than 200 mod packs with just a click of a button, and you could do all of that in less than five minutes. Then Apex Hosting is the perfect service for you. Use the first link in the description for 25% off. Something that I personally love about Apex Hosting, besides them having locations all around the world, so no matter where you are, you have a good connection, is that you could access a server console through your phone, meaning that you could be away from the house and just control your server, kick people out, change the settings, whatever you want to do, you could do through your phone. I'm going to leave that first link in the description for you to take advantage of this deal real quick. And now let's keep going with the tutorial. As soon as Forge downloaded, let's go ahead and drag and drop it into our desktop. It should be a jar file, something like this, the one you see right here. Now with Forge in our desktop, we're almost ready to start. The first thing you want to make sure you do is close your Minecraft launcher as well as your Minecraft game. And also it is very important that you have played Minecraft 1.21 at least once in your computer to create an instance for it okay but once you open the game you could close it and close the launcher as well the next step is to right click on the forge installer you're gonna go ahead and click on open with and you're gonna use your java it's very important that you have java installed and specifically java 21 if you don't have java 21 installed on your computer this won't work okay the reason being is because after the update 1.20.5 for minecraft it now requires you to have java 21 to install any type of mod to create a server or use any plugins or stuff like that you will need java 21 if you don't have java 21 though i'm gonna leave this guide in the description on how to download and install java 21 is super simple you download the file you literally open the installer click next a couple of times it will install and that's it you could close the installer and delete the installer file for java 21 if you don't know what java you have you could always click on search here and then type auto remove programs and right here you could just search for java right here in search apps and see which java you have as you can see i already have java 21 if you have java 21 and something else and it's still not working you might have to get rid of your older versions of java but let's assume that you finally got java 21 installed and you were able to open the forge installer the next step is to just click ok here on the installer and wait for forge to install it's that simple and as you can see forge just finished installing so let's go ahead and click on ok and now you could even delete the installer because you don't need it anymore now we already installed forge 1.21 so if you already have some mods that you want to try out with forge 1.21 go ahead and just add it to your mods folder which i'm going to show you where to find right now and you could try this mod loader me personally i'm going to download some mods to try as well i'm specifically going to download biomes of plenty if you want to use the same mod as me i'm going to leave the link in the description just come over here to files choose the 1.21 version make sure it's the forge one click on this three dots click download file and you will download the biomes of plenty forge file for 1.21 okay that's if you want to test the same mod as me now i almost forgot guys if you're gonna use biomes of plenty as i am going to use it you're also gonna need glitch core and you're also going to need terra blender so in order to download those you just come over here to biomes of plenty head over to the description let's scroll down and click on glitch core that'll bring you over here we're gonna click on files and we're gonna download the 1.21 forge just download that file and we're also going to download the terra blender so just scroll down here in the biomes of plenty click on forge right here and then just head over to files and download the 1.21 for forge as well so go ahead and download that file and you're gonna add those into your mods folder as well okay now how do you find that mods folder to add the mods once you open your minecraft launcher if you install forge properly you should see here selected automatically as you can see mine is right there and to add the mods we're gonna head over to installations we're gonna make sure we see forge in here okay make sure you click on mod it because if you don't click on mod it you won't see forge in here and just in case if you don't see forge in here you could always click on new installation name this whatever you want so like for example apex hosting and then where it says version just look for forge mine is right here it's one of the most recent ones and then just click create here on the bottom right and that'll make an instance of forge anyways once you located forge in here go ahead and hover over it and click on this little folder that appears right next to the play button that is going to open a folder with a lot of files in it but we're now specifically looking for a folder called mods m-o-d-s my mods folder is right here there's a chance that you don't have the mods folder so i'm actually gonna go ahead and delete mine and let's act like i didn't have the mods folder okay what do you do here don't worry all you have to do is create a new folder and just name that folder mods just name it mods you could create the mods folder yourself what you're gonna do next is open that mods folder app and you're going to drag and drop all those mods 
mods that you want to use with Porsche 1.21 and make sure that they are made for the Porsche loader. Okay, if you add fabric mods in here, you're going to have your Porsche crash. Once you added the mods in here, you will close this folder, head back into your Minecraft launcher and just play your Porsche edition. Just hit play, click that you understand the risk of playing modern Minecraft. And as you can see, Minecraft just opened and we're going to go ahead and test out these mods. Let's go ahead and head over to single player and create a new world using our biomes of plenty. If you're using some other mods, well, just go ahead and launch your world. Some mods won't work on multiplayer because some mods are server side mods and some of them are client side. Some mods won't work in multiplayer. You will need to add the mods into the server folder and you will need to be the owner of the server, which you could easily be an owner of the server if you use the first link in the description to create your own server. And as you can see, we're now inside the world. And yeah, this is biomes of plenty right here. As you can see, this is already a different biome. There we go. So we made sure that the mod is working and we know that Forge 1.21 is now working. I hope this video was useful. If it was, don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment. And as always, bye bye.